there are horses running on the highway. The midweek rush hour was a little different than most for dozens of drivers along Interstate 74. All of a sudden I looked up to the left and thought, oh wow, there's horses on the highway. And I went, horses? Wait a minute. And I looked, three, no saddles, picked up the phone, dialed 911 right away. 911 emergency to such a gym. Uh, yeah, there's three horses, no saddles on I-74. Tina Brown's 911 call was one of several to Hamilton County Dispatch about four horses on the loose on 74 between Dry Fork Road and 275. To us, it has, ne it has never happened, and, you know, we are going to do everything in our power to make sure it never happens again. I never want to get that phone call again. Owner Casey Kellums says four of her family's 15 horses found a spot on their 34 acres of land where part of the fence had fallen. This is Aspen. She seemed on the video, she seemed to be our ringleader. <laughs> Aspen, Diva, Little Mare, and Scooby are all show horses for the Kellum family. The Kellums say the experience was terrifying, but they are incredibly grateful for how the public stepped up to help. Just the people that were sitting on the highway being patient, people weren't honking their horns, people weren't yelling and screaming. Just that alone, you know, kept things from escalating to having a real tragedy. The Kellums family says it has been raising horses on its farm for more than 50 years, and it is already working to fix that fence to make sure this doesn't happen again. Reporting live in Harrison, Emily Wood, WLWT News 5.